Hey guys, welcome back in Korea Mongla YT and in this video we are going to learn how you can basically set up the FPP game buttons. So let's start. So first of all, I will be first of all rename this the image or icons and this is for fire. We will use this bullet for fire and there's a reload. Okay, so just uh, name that reload. Okay, now first of all what I do, I just go in my player and also open my player ui that is the basically the main ui and then at here basically at the button that is for you can you for now you'll be used for this fire and it's like that uh f i r e fire so i'm not sure that why it's <laughs> typing like that come on fire what the heck is this <laughs> however uh now let's say it here that brush is b to brush and then here now let's the set up the inner the icons um then we'll be simply drag and drop this uh for mm. viewers this is for aim and mm -hmm. there's this one and this one and where did that go one more uh this one so that is basically difference so as you can see the image is looking very bad so for fixing this problem what you can do basically now uh, first of all set a, a good size so that's 150 i think for that is good and then you need to set it to in a uh, box to image it will be work automatically then okay just set all the stuff to box to image so it will be work uh, fine like that compile and save okay now that is basically our fire fire button so then let's set the gravity to right side compile and save now if i click on play uh, as you can see the button is coming that is quite enough good at, at a good position and then i want my joystick at this position so for adding that thing uh controlling the basically the joystick i need to basically uh, set up go to plug a uh, uh, at here it's project settings maps and modes uh not in maps and modes you need to basically go to inputs and set here to leave virtual joystick and so show always then saved so as you can see your joystick has been come but it's uh, uh set up we need to do some setup so just go and inputs double click and open Mm -hmm. and and just click on this touch zero position and we need to just set up at here so that is 150 and by 50 and 50 by 150 okay now save this thing now if i click on play so as you can see it's quite enough now good uh okay that is in a good position so if you want you can also make the uh size okay virtual joystick size so let's also set it to 150 by 150 uh i think that is a look uh, more good and make sure that is enable saved and uh, now saved okay as you can see that is now looking more perfect okay okay nice so now what you need to do is basically uh first of all uh we need to set up some more buttons out here because i also want that reload and other stuff so other switches so that is for fire duplicate one more and for the reload i'll be used at here also there's a, also can i add a one more fire button if you want you know double fire button like that and however for at here i'll be use the reload so just go to again content slash icons and then i'll be use the basically the reload one like that and set here that reload compile and saved okay so at the reload button you can make that uh, some smaller okay kind of like a little bit smaller 120 that is now be small for this one okay now make sure always you set up the gravity or it will be not work okay let's see that how it's looking okay it's in the up it's looking very nice then with this thing i'll be at the aim button so user came aim also so but there's a problem if there's a user aiming so he need, then he'll be used that uh, the same at this left side okay so we need to keep it fine so for that i'll be set it uh, the uh, aim button at here okay uh, let me do some fakes at here maybe i just you know 120 and then duplicate 
said uh, here where that go oh where are you where are that I'm not sure duplicate take that at here and at here will be simply now set it to 150 again because I want that same size and then in the icons I'll be use the aim one like that okay so here's a basically the all the icon system has been done okay like everything is not pretty much enough good at here as you can see uh, maybe there's some gravity problem let me check uh, the both gravity are okay now maybe it's done yeah now quite enough that both are good so now i need to set up that uh this uh with this bullet we can basically control our player so for do that what i do i add some action first of all the fire one so just go to for now that on press and i want one more for release then come in main player and wherever your fire function is working for now in my case that is in at here so just create some here if a uh, custom event that fire on and that is fire on and i'll be do one more custom block that custom event that fire off so for now i will remove the pc uh, control and connect it with my mobile control okay and for the reload simply i just create a custom event that is for uh, reload and simply uh, that is a non reload system that is the reload system and simply connected with this thing and for the aim that is a simple like fire custom event dot aim and custom event aim off okay aim off okay now simply just double click and disable and connected with this thing okay our all the custom events has been done now we need to come in ui and just get the player and just to do like the fire fire on and again search fire fire off oh let me check one more thing that is a fire on um fire one one two three let me check that i have said the right one or not maybe i'm seeing some confusion out here yes as you can see i want to use the fire one two three this one okay and then i need for the aim that i'll be use the same that press and oh i can also do from at here but i like from this so just give it that aim and then simply scroll down and set here one more time at here i'll be set that aim and i search one more time that aim off aim and aim off compile saved and then this one's reload so that is only i need for one time so basically you just click on click so at here reload and connect it now your ui will be work with your basically player if i now just go to project select settings slash and i search here that uh, mouse and i just enable the mouse inputs at here so if i show you as you can see the fire is working uh that is for reload okay so as you can see the reload also okay and the aim that is also working okay so i hope you understand thank you so much for watching guys love you all bye bye see you in next video